I'm Laura Cornelius and these are your highlights from Week 8's Eurasian Heads Up Play. The third and final match of the evening was Berlin Bear Soral Mitzi, who was always late to the show, versus Timothy Adams of the Rome Emperors. Tim Adams took a slight lead in the very early stages of the first game, thanks to rivering a straight. From there, he was able to scoop a few more pots. In hand 70, Sorrel chose to bluff on the river, going all in, thinking Tim would not have the ace of hearts. However, he did, so it didn't go so well, losing a few more chips in the process. There were a lot of all-ins for Mitzi, and he got lucky in all of them, thereby winning the first game for the Bears in the end. Three points to gruesome side. In game two, would the run good for Sorrel Mitzi continue? Well, in hand 47, it was threes for Sorrel and King Jack for Timothy. Sorrel went for the flip and flopped the set. He admitted it's not even fair anymore in terms of the luck that was running his way. And in the very next hand, Sorrel held the ace 10 of diamonds. He just happened to hit the straight and make it two games to one for the Berlin Bears, taking their points up to 74 and looking to win a sixth consecutive heads up match in a row. In game three, hand 10 saw a very dangerous spot for Mitzi, who hit top pair against Timothy Adams' aces. He thought he was good, but when Adams bet out on the river, he was contemplating all the options for a while. He made the fold eventually, and rightly so. Adams taking a lead in this final game, several hands later, and Sorrell finally lost a game. Tim Adams taking three points for the Rome Emperors. Berlin on 74.